North Korea is building artificial islands in the Yellow Sea and topping them with what appear to be military installations, satellite images reveal. The development suggests that North Korea has taken a cue from China, which has been stoking regional tensions by building and militarizing several artificial islands in the South China Sea in recent years. The images show that North Korea has been working for at least five years on the islands near Sohei, about 70 miles northwest of Pyongyang, the capital of North Korea. Sohei is known as a testing site for intercontinental ballistic missile technology. As late as 2012, three of the islands, which are scattered around a small peninsula jutting into the Yellow Sea, were rocky, tree-studded specks. Two were patches of sand. In Google Earth images from December 2016, all appear to contain features consistent with military installations such as wide roads and paved rectangular lots. All are in North Korea's waters close to the country's shoreline. Their purpose remains unclear. North Korea could use the islands for ballistic missile launches, anti-aircraft weapons, anti-ship weapons, or even, or even for agriculture with no military purpose in mind whatsoever. But at this point, it is completely unclear and appears to be being set up for military activity. Yet, the North Koreans build just about everything for dual purpose, said Steve Sin, a researcher on unconventional weapons and technology at the University of Maryland. So building something that is of military use on an agricultural project is certainly within its usual pattern. North Korea has been known to test launch missiles from airports that is ostensibly built for civilian use. Sin went on to say that if the islands are used for missile launches, they're probably not intended for long range ballistic missiles. North Korea still has to stack and fuel those at the launch site itself, he said. It's more likely that they are intended for short-range missiles such as the KN-02 and Scud missiles, which are more portable, he said. He added the islands themselves aren't particularly surprising. All countries with coastlines have been reclaiming coastal land for various purposes for hundreds if not thousands of years, and North Korea is no exception. What do you think? Is North Korea building these islands and preparing them for all-out war in that region? of the world? Leave your comments below this video. Thanks for watching.